Hi, how you doing? This is Lerone. I have my Paige Lee shirt on today because hopefully I'm going to get to meet Peter Max. Now, Peter Max is a world-renowned artist, right? Now, the significance of me meeting Peter Max today is very, very profound, okay? It's going to mean a whole lot to me if I get a chance to meet this guy because in 1969, my father was a shipping clerk in Manhattan, right? And my father used to ship most of Peter Max's artwork around the world and around the country. And my father was a community activist, okay? My father um, created the Tenant Patrol in New York City Housing Authority. And I said that, you heard it, and that's what I meant to say. He created the Tenant Patrol for the New York City Housing Authority, all right? During the course of his career, back in the 60s, my father had a lot of articles that were written about him. Um, Amsterdam News, The Recorder, a lot of newspapers from back then wrote articles about my dad. Being that Peter Max knew my dad, my dad took these articles to Peter Max. And Peter Max put together this collage of my dad's articles. This is just half. I have it folded. It comes out, you know, twice as long. And Peter Max, in the middle of the collage, he says, Dear John, my father's name was John. Dear John, keep up the good work. Love, Peter Max. Right? And I've had this in my house, and my family have had this in my house since the 60s, since 69, when Peter Max made this collage of all these different things that my father had done. And um, now here it is, 2017. And I would like to have Peter Max, I would like to see his reaction when he sees this. I would like to know whether he remembers my dad, and I would like to know whether he will sign this for me. So, I'm in Georgia right now, at my home in Georgia, I'm going to Phipps Mall or Phipps Plaza, where there's an art gallery where he's gonna be. He doesn't know I'm coming. So hopefully I can talk to him for a minute and we'll see what happens. So stay tuned. Yeah, Coons family. K-O-O-N-C Wow. Okay, I'm back home here in Atlanta, Georgia. Um, I've just returned from Wentworth Art Gallery. It's 3500 Peachtree Road in Atlanta, Georgia, in Phipps Plaza. Okay, the reason why I wanted to give them a shout out because they were very kind to me and my wife. Um, when I first arrived there, security approached me. They were very animate about me not bringing anything into the gallery and I could understand that because there's a lot of expensive artwork at this particular gallery. Um, and then when I showed them what I had, they kind of were more receptive to me bringing it in, but then they were adamant about the fact that he's not going to sign anything. He's not here to sign anything, I guess, other than what he's selling at, the, at this um, art gallery. So I understood that too, but I was able to convince them to let me bring the article in and show it to him and um, he was very well as I said I had to go through security I guess the curators of the 
gallery, they also approached me, and as I got a little further in, other security approached me about the same issue over and over again, about not being able to bring that in or not being able to have it signed. So it kind of got annoying, but I understand why. It's a very high-end um, art gallery, and they don't want uh, probably to let people in and with items and things like that. Whatever the reason, I was able to get in, thankfully. Um, I got to the table, I spread the um, document out, I showed um, Mr. Max the um, document, and I don't think he remembered it. I don't think he remembered my dad. It was 48 years ago, in 1969, as a given. But he was very kind to me, um, he listened to me, and he was amazed <laughs> when he saw that he actually did do this, and he saw his signature on this document. and. It changed the whole flow of the conversation once he realized that it was his work and also his aides. I don't know whether they were his relatives or his aides or his publicist. They were there, two young ladies were there, and they, their eyes just lit up when they saw the fact that he had signed that in 1969. He created that um, collage. So at that point, they asked him to sign. They said that it was okay for him to sign. So he pulled out his pen, and that's what we have a video. We were allowed to film at that point. We didn't get the whole conversation that we had. We had like about a 10 minute conversation before he actually signed. But he did sign the document. Um, I just w wanted to say thank you to Peter Max. Um, he's a very kind and gracious um, man, artist. I would like to also say thank you to the people that were with him as well as the people at Whitworth Art Gallery in Phipps Plaza, 3500 Peachtree Road in Atlanta, Georgia, for allowing me to come to that event to present that and have him have Peter Max sign it. So, thanks you, thank you for coming with me on the journey. And until next time, have a nice day. Go Falcons. <laughs>